too soon by gun violence. The victim was known for giving back to the community, and today it was the community's turn to give back in her honor. Fox 2's Veronica Meadows with the update. New shoes, new clothes, and lots of support. That's what some members of Alternatives for Girls walked into at the Foot Locker on 8 Mile near Kelly in East Point. This is very nice and thoughtful. Around a dozen girls spent a $100 gift card donated by the shoe company on Sunday. This shopping trip is in honor of 18 year old Casey Willis. The former Foot Locker employee and Alternatives for Girls board member was shot and killed last month in Highland Park. Her family's still in shock. This is the toughest thing I've ever had to do. I don't wish this on anyone. But on the bright side, it feels good knowing that Casey was such a remarkable person. Casey was definitely for everyone. Willis was known as a role model with a big heart. She always went out of her way to help people at the organization that provides resources for girls in Detroit. She just wanted to help people, like young girls, the youth, like she really, she wanted to help people. Like we've been in so many different environments and we came out on top. And she wanted to share those experiences with young girls that this could be you. Meanwhile, Foot Locker wanted to remember Willis by giving back to her loved ones. I think it's important to, you know, celebrate life, right? You know, and thinking about uh, how important this organization was to Casey, right? And her family being here and being supportive of it, you know, uh, is, is, really, is really heartwarming. Now as police investigate, family and friends continue to grieve. While their hearts are broken, the people here are grateful for their new shoes and clothes. Above all, they appreciate Foot Locker's support as they carry on Willis's memory. I feel like I'm shopping with her and for her because it's in honor of her. And without her being such a good person, I don't think we would have got it today. Foot Locker also donated $16,500 in gift cards so each of the 165 members of Alternatives for Girls can shop on their own. In East Point, Veronica Meadows, Fox 2 News.